Today we're going to take a look at how to install the bush hammers on a Diamatic 7 series grinder. First we'll look at the parts we need to start the installation. You will need three bush hammer plates with the cutters installed, three fork plates for mounting, three buffer discs, 12 grommets for the plates, three large retaining rings, and the mounting bolts and washers that are included with the kit. Refer to the Diamatic 2016 tooling catalog for a complete list of the parts. Begin by placing the grommets in the holes from the back side of the cutter plate. Tap these into place using a hammer. Before we can install the bush hammers, we need to remove the existing tooling plates and more flex couplers from the machine using a 5 8 socket. Next, Remove the tooling plate adapter using a 6 mm Allen. You may reuse the same bolts for installing the fork plate, or you can use three 6 mm bolts with lock washers included with the kit. Mount the fork plate to the axle and tighten securely. Next, we push the buffer disc all the way onto the fork plate, making sure that it's seated completely flush. Now we can mount the bush hammer cutter plate by pressing the plate onto the forks With the grommets in place, this will take some pressure. Sitting in front of the machine is the easiest way to get the plate pressed on. After the plate is in place, install the center bolt using the two washers that are supplied with it and tighten securely. This will press the plate completely onto the fork. The last step is to install the retaining ring. Using a pair of snap ring pliers, install the retaining ring inside of the forks. This is what actually holds the bush hammers in place. Repeat the same steps for all three heads and you're ready to roll.